What's up, everybody? Jason here from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Doing 1920 Upper Deck Artifacts Hockey. It's a 10 box inner case break. Pick your team's number three. So you can see the change of studio. We thought maybe it was just the main studio. Started streaming here on my uh, own studio over here. In the other room, it looks like it might have just been our broadcasting software. So again, I know it's been a little shaky tonight, guys. I appreciate it. Here you go. Artifacts Hockey. Last spot mojo was Rick Thomas with the Rangers. And we had an early bird, guys. All you had to do was be uh, a customer that bought the first 18 spots in this break. 18 teams sold. And you'll be randomized uh, to win 10 packs of overtime wave packs to one winner uh, at the end of the break. We'll ship them to you sealed. I do have the list of customer names here. The top 18 started with Don, Andy with Stephen K. We'll roll the dice and randomize them at the end of the break. And there you go. Showed you guys the list. Here is the case. Remember, it's a master 20 box case. Two inners. Raher. So they choose left or right. And again, this is the new draft class. All right. Shit, I don't even have a die right here. One, two, three, left side, four, five, six, right side is the one we use for this break. Which is usually as well. Get a new dice roll. I don't have any on my studio over here. And it is a six. So we'll go the right side. One, two, three, four, five, six. We use this side. This will be for the next picker team. Here you go. And again, um, all rookie redemptions, wild cards, Roman numeral uh, redemptions and wild cards will go uh, randomized to the group of customers in the break besides number one. If we get rookie number one, that'll go to the New Jersey Devils. And I believe Joe did it a certain way. Uh, I, I think it was supposed to be another way, but uh, he did it a certain way. And I believe that whenever he pulled a wild card or Roman numeral, he put it down. And he did them the way it came out in order. So if Roman numeral this one came out, wild card came out, etc., etc., that's the way he did it. So I'm going to have to stick by that. So just a little FYI. I know in the past we've done it where, like, the best Roman numeral is the number one, the relic was two, and etc., etc. But since Joe did it that way, I can't really change it up anymore. So whatever uh, order it comes out in is the way we're going to randomize it. got Rome's cars. Jason's rig? What do you mean? What does that mean? And let's go. Artifacts hockey. I don't I don't understand why would I rig you guys? What does that mean? Guys, good luck. All right, first one is Carl Grundstrom, artifacts rookie to two ninety nine. Little base blank. We got a Nico Heischer Urum card. You can also collect the set as well and win some prizes, I believe. And we got a rookie redemption so far for the Blue uh, New Jersey Devils, red one ninety eight. So again, that'll go to the Devils. Right there. And we got Ryan Poling to 999. Top rookie there for the Montreal Canadiens. I not that I want to follow Joe's rules, just that that's the way he broke it. If I broke it a different way, it would be rigged. You get me? So if, if Joe numbers the boxes, or I number the boxes first. We just got to go by whatever we did first. Can't really just switch it up. Like, oh, well, I'm not Joe, so I'm going to do it a different way. You get me? It'd just be unethical that way. And it's just like, that would be rigged. Doing it a different way. Because some people would be like, hey, if you would have done it this way, I would have got this card instead of this card. 
and vice versa. So it's not really being rigged, it's just going by being fair. Trying to do everything the same. And Tyson Jost to 65. Double relic. All right, Logan, no worries, man. All right, let's call it Avalanche. Next one. Yeah, every box doesn't automatically mean autograph either. Sometimes it'll be two relics or two rel uh, autos or two whatever it is. I believe, I don't know how many hits are in a box actually. How many hits are in a box? Including three autograph and really cards or arm bounding cards. So yeah, it could be a mixture of three autos, it could be a mixture of three relics, three arms. But for the most part, there's a fair share of autographs as well. Alright, next one. We got Zach McOwen to three ninety nine for Vancouver. And we got Patrick Kane. Yes, Gretzky is all over the Kings checklist. But yes, he is, autograph-wise. And then we got a Rookie Redemption for the Buffalo Sabres. Red 184. So that'll go strictly to the Buffalo Sabres. Only wild card and Roman numerals will go. Everybody have a shot at that except number one. And we got Brandstrom to 999. And we got Taro to 499. Double Relic. For the Red Wings. What about the Red Wings? Stephen K with the Red Wings. Then we got Frederick Anderson to 99. To 99, Matthew Barzell. And then we got Jonathan Taves. Triple Relic. Triple Color. A uh, three color relic to 25. Lord Stanley's Legacy Relics. There you go. Blackhawks. Tony with that one. Next one. You guys, you can collect the bounty, claim it for your 0506 arm retro cards numbered 49 and 50. Next one. And again, the second half is in the store as well. One. To 85, Nick Levy. Got Drew Dottie to 299. Team Tundras, or Tundra teammates, Ryan Nugent Hopkins and Darnell Nurse to 189 for the Oilers. Lewis with that one. Uh, I don't think so. Not that I remember of. Teddy. Blueger to 9.99. Then we got a Quinn Hughes. That is uh, Jack Hughes's older brother. Drafted by Vancouver two years ago. 
So he'd be a good player for them as well. And there you go. There's our first wild card rookie redemption. So, number one, we'll get this first and we'll put him just face down that way to figure out which one it is. Ryan Johansson. And look at this. We got a JT John Tavares, number to 99. Nice one. Toronto Maple Leafs with that one. Travis. Very cool looking card as well. And James Neal, double relic to 165. Calgary Flames. Brennan. Next one. Well, yeah, I think James Neal was still with the Flames, isn't he? Or did he get did he get cut already? Or traded? I know he was a Flame a year ago. Oh, yeah. The, oh, that's right, huh? Yeah. James Neal kind of fell off the earth when... Uh, After he left Vegas. Oh, yeah, yeah, gotcha, gotcha. Actually, did I miss this? That's a Cam Atkinson, a 699. And we got Nikita Kucherov to 99 for the Tampa Bay Lightning. And a Vegas Golden Knights rookie redemption. Levi Johnson with that one. And we got Jonathan Marshall. So. And Logan Couture to 165 for the Sharks. Ilya Kovalchuk to 85. Grundstrom for my Kings. And we got a Frederick Anderson double patch to 25 for the Toronto Maple Leafs. There you go. All right. Halfway through the break, after we finish this box, still plenty of hits hiding there. Not many autographs to start out, so I expect there to be a handful of autographs starting coming up. Uh, yeah, Aaron, I'm gonna go to the Eagles Jets game. Um. Doing a red eye Thursday night, getting there Friday morning, uh, taking my mom to Atlantic City so she can gamble at the casinos for the day. Going with my wife, uh, taking my mom for her birthday. Her birthday's on Saturday. And then uh, my older sister's going. Yeah, taking her to Atlantic City on Friday to kind of gamble a little bit. Saturday, we're going to drive out to Washington, D.C., check that out. And there you go. Autofax, Scott Lofton, Lofton, for the Flyers. There you go, Nick. And then uh, Eagles game on Sunday. And we have a rookie relic redemption two gold jersey jersey. Nice. It's rookie number two right there. I probably sells pretty well, guys. So that will be number two on the checklist, or two on the randomizer. I mean. Cal Maker, or Maker, Maker, to 399. And uh, Dante Fabro, to 499. And then enjoy Philadelphia on uh, end of Sunday, Monday.
Nolan Patrick to 99. So those uh, rookie redemptions uh, are to be determined players. So they ended up selling for a lot because a lot of people think that they're this player, that player. So they sell pretty well. And Miro Heishkinen, year one rookie sweaters for Dallas. But they don't announce who they are till about like December, January. So we have to randomize them. But if, if we break this later on in January and the checklist is out, then it'll go by the checklist. But since it's not out yet, um, we just randomize until everybody has a shot. Except rookie number one. It's usually always the number one overall pick. So Jack Hughes for the Devils. So if we pull a rookie number one, that'll go to the Devils. Yeah, it's kind of a, it's actually, it's kind of a smart idea if you think about it, right? I mean, it's not like they can't produce the cards. <laughs> it's just that I'm assuming that either they just didn't get the autographs in time or, yeah, they just kind of like to make it a little suspenseful that way. But it's only usually for artifacts okay, when they do that. It's kind of like Bowman when they do, like, the, uh, you know, fan favorite, you know, redemptions or something like that and to be determined or something. Like that. Yeah, kind of like the XRC cards and stuff like that. So kind of like their version, I guess, yeah. <clears throat> In a way. All right. Then we got Steven Stamkos. To 99 for the Bolts. Who has the Bolts? Pazzo Giannis. Uh, Rookie Redemption for the Flyers. There you go, Nick. Yeah, we should do some of those hockey books. That's a quick break we can fill. Adam Henrique for the Ducks to 299. Then we got ugh, Ryan Getzlaff for the Ducks. Going to Sean. And we got Nathan Bastain to 499. Devils. And polling. Maybe not. Montreal Canadiens. Mike Luck. Hartford Whalers. That'll be going to the Carolina Hurricanes. And for the Pittsburgh Penguins. Nice triple relic. Teddy Bulger. Is going to Don. Oh man, I, I think the Devils are going to be solid in like two years. Give them two years. They might not be that good this year, but yeah, Hall will definitely be the older veteran. But yeah, you got Nico Heesh here. You're going to have Jack Hughes, and Jack Hughes is already scoring <laughs> in the preseason. Might have to get a little better goaltender, goaltending at least. I don't know if Corey Schneider is really the future for them. I'm not even sure if he's there no more. But um, I think the Devils are pretty solid in a couple years. the Rangers are going to be good too, man. Well, yeah, I forgot McKenzie. Is he actually finally going to come up? McKenzie Blackwood has been around for a little bit now. Is he finally going to come up? But yeah, the Rangers are going to be pretty solid too. I really love their draft pick this year. I think he should have been number one. And look at that. Wow, Don Rapp. You're going to get yourself a horn. I know you've been looking for an Evgeny Malkin autograph. And there you go. Lord Stanley's Legacy Signatures. Nice. As Drake says, thank me later. 
Rookie Redemption, Florida Panthers. Red 193. Frederick to nine ninety nine and Brendan Gallagher to one sixty five McDonough to ninety nine Bill Ranford to five ninety nine and Brady Kachuk, top uh, rear one rookie sweater, sorry. Ottawa Senators. All right, three boxes to go, guys. Yvon Cornier. And wow, look at this. We got autographed rookie redemption, rookie number eight. There you go. Nice. So again, the way Joe did it, I'm going to have to keep it the same way. This will be number three on the randomizer. We'll get this one. We got a rookie redemption for the Ducks. Red 181. Brock Besser to 399. And uh, Andre Savechnikov to 165 for the Hurricanes. Jeff Skinner to 45. Clint Keller and Rasmus Dahlin, year one rookie sweaters for the Sabres. Yeah, you know, all those older veterans went to Dallas this year. Dallas can do some damage this year. Two boxes to go. Series was pretty good. All right, Kyle Ocposo to two ninety nine, and we got Franz Nielsen to one sixty five. We got Roman Yossi to forty five, Nashville Predators. Jonathan Quick to six ninety nine. And we got Brent Seabrook, Lord Stanley's Legacy Relic for the Hawks. And we got Zach 
Sen Yashin. I don't know how to pronounce some of these names either. Some of these newer hockey names I got to really love. Oh, wow. Is this what I think it is? Jeez. Hold on. Put that down right there. Wildcard Rookie Redemption. That'll be four on the randomizer. All right. Let's see who's behind Kyle Torres. But it's a rookie, though. Wow, it's a one of one for the Vancouver Canucks. K dot Stephen K. Canadian laundry tag and a three color patch. I wish this was uh, Jack Hughes's brother, but there you go. Still one of one rookie. I seen the black right here, guys. I'm like, all right, it's a one of one. <laughs> Very nice. For the Nucks. Sweet. All righty. Good luck, everybody. Last box. I don't know, Liam. You know, those Ricky Redemptions can get you like up to like 10 bucks. So, it's not like entirely lost that much. And again, you just have a chance to win these right here. You might get that autographed Ricky Redemption. And I'm sure your $20 will be well worth it. Alright, good luck, guys. Evander Kane. Looks like we got another rookie redemption coming up. Or no. This is just Radrick Fasca. Dallas Stars. And Winnipeg Jets rookie redemption. Going to Brody. Red 211. Quinn Hughes to 399. So that's Jack Hughes' older brother. Or his twin brother, one or the other. Jacob Silverberg to 165. No, I think it is his older brother, although they look alike. Jordan Bennington to 99. Matthew Barzell. And. Sveshnikov, you're one rookie sweaters. There you go, folks. That was the break. Solid hits all around, including a one on one rookie. Double jersey auto. These rookie redemptions, we need to be randomized, and as well as the uh, 10 overtime wave pack. So, again, the way Joe did them is the way they came out in order. Number one on the randomizer is going to get the wild card rookie redemption. Number two is going to get the rookie. Relic Redemption, Gold. Number three in the randomizer is going to get Autograph Rookie Redemption, number eight. And number four in the randomizer is going to get the Wild Card Rookie Redemption. Then we use the same dice roller for the Early Bird, which was the first 18 teams taken. Here they are right here. And then customer names, everybody has a shot at this. So we use the same dice roll for this one as well. So let's roll it first for the 10 overtime wave packs and we'll ship them to you sealed. All right? It is. Yes. 10 overtime wave packs. 
Uh, I don't know. You were the first 18 bot uh, after 11 times. Your early customer names. Don, Lewis, Brandon. No, probably not, Chad. There you go. 11 times. One. Come on, random.org. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleventh final time. Lewis at the top. There you go. 10 overtime wave packs coming your way. Bought the caps like three days ago? Well, I'm not sure. I just went by the top 18 and I filled in the remaining like three or four. But we could figure it out. Maybe you're in number four, so. Yeah, I'm not too sure, man. No, you just bought the caps today. Didn't you? I don't know. But you weren't in this. Sorry, man. We'll figure it out, though. Lewis. 10 OT wave. Either that or there was 18 other customers that bought before you. All right. And this is for the autograph. Or this is for the four redemption cards. Remember the way they're laid out? One, two, three, four. Top four, get them. And that is uh, 11 times as well. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, ten, eleven. After eleven times, top four. Liam, you're at number four. There you go, a little wild card redemption. See, play to the whistle, man. Number three, Tony C. Travis at number two. Rookie Relic Redemption number two. And at number one, Levi. So there you go. Top four. There you go, guys. This was uh, Artifacts Hockey. Probably can't do it tonight, although because we're running out of time. But tomorrow we can do uh, Pick Your Team number four. Right here. 17 left. And there's still a handful of early bird spots available to have a chance to win the uh, overtime wave packs. And number four, guys, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Appreciate it.